Back in 1970, I saw uh, Jesus Christ Superstar in Australia. And I was so impressed with the musical and lyrical brilliance of Andrew Lloyd Webber and Tim Rice. And I immediately thought, well, because they ended on the cross, you see, they were telling the story of Christ as a man, but they missed the part, this, the next 40 days, which is, in the, which is the key part of the Gospels, which actually presents Christ as God. I then realized that it would be really cool if we could create a musical that, that was like Jesus Christ Superstar 2. We needed to tell the story of the next 40 days in Jerusalem after the cross. So I wanted to tell the story about those 40 days that started at the cross and ended at the Ascension. So about 1995, I started writing it, and then it went onto the shelf in 1996 for about 25 years. You know, my day job kind of took over, and it's only last year that I then have taken it off the shelf, and I've now become really energized to complete the Ascension musical, because I think this part of the story, which Jesus Christ Superstar deliberately omitted to to tell because they were presenting Christ as a man I feel I felt that this part of the story really needs to get told before I finally leave the planet and go and meet Jesus myself I first started writing it in a restaurant um, scribbling on the back of a placemat in a little like cafe in Montreal called Rubens I still have that placemat actually and I've cherished it because it was the beginnings of, of, the, uh, of the musical in 1995. The instruments you'll hear are full orchestration. So everything you would see in a full orchestra from violins to, uh, you know, to oboes, to bassoons, to, it's a full orchestration. Uh, but you will also hear uh, what I've wanted to bring in is some Eastern, when I say Eastern, I mean Israeli type sounds, because that's where it actually occurs. So you will hear things like zithers, and, um, and sitars playing some of the background uh, stuff uh, because I think that gives it a bit of a flavor of where it was actually originally set. The final song in the musical is Jesus ascending from the beach in Galilee. So the whole pinnacle, the end of the, of the musical is actually the ascension. So the, it was the obvious name because it, the, the musical takes you from the, the cross all the way to the beach and the ascension. Well, since I took it off the shelf, I've been working flat out for the last four months to get uh, the, the music and the lyrics fine-tuned. And I am about to leave uh, for South Africa, actually for Cape Town, where together with a, a producer that I've worked for for years and an assembled cast, we're going to be finalizing the production. And I've realized I really need to get this story out. And so shortly, by the end of March, we will have Ascension, the musical.